Hello ladies and gentlemen, William Pocket here. I want to show you how to export XML files from DaVinci Resolve over to After Effects. So I got my sequence right over here. And what you would normally do is you would go to the Deliver tab and then click on something like Premiere XML. But the problem with that is that it actually exports a render. Uh, so say you want to extend the clips, that's not going to work inside of After Effects or Premiere in this case. So what you instead want to do is you want to go to file, you want to go to export AAF XML, you want to choose FCP7 XML version 5, I've already got it saved here but it doesn't matter, I'll just, yes, replace that, there we go, and now we just jump over to After Effects. So inside of After Effects, you go over to import, and then pro import for After Effects, this actually took me about two days to figure out, took about a weekend. So you choose Final Cut Profiles XML, and then you jump into your project folder. I'm already in here. I've uh, done this on repeat about two times now. Always fail those takes, man. This is my first tutorial. What are you going to do? And what's ha been happening now is it's pretty much just fetched. The footage that DaVinci Resolve is fetching here, and what it's been doing is it's simply just made a composition out of everything. So here we go. Here we have all of the exactly the way it looks inside of DaVinci Resolve and this what's so cool about this is I can just zoom into the clip view here and say I want to make this clip a little bit longer boom boom there we go and it's longer so this is the power of this if you want to do some speed ramping or you want to add some effects which I definitely will do uh, to this video um, then it's it's just such a great workflow and then of course out of After Effects uh, if you want to render this out what I would do is I would add to render queue choose the best settings of course always 1080p that's always nice and then I would choose uh, QuickTime and I would choose Apple ProRes 422HQ if you want to export this over to DaVinci Resolve again and then do like the final color grading or something like that uh, it just works a lot better than something like DNX HD. I figured uh, there's like some weird banding going on when I choose this option right here. So I would uh, suffice that you choose ProRes uh, HQ, just so you know. Um, and that's really it. Have a great morning, day, evening, or night. Uh, drink some nice coffee, some nice evening tea, whatever. I wish you a fantastic day. This is William Alpaca signing off.